Rev it up for us. I don't want to rev it up. Try to reach for the other one. That, that, that gas right there. Right there? Yeah, the no, the other one. Yep. The other one. Yep. 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 <laughs> well, what's your channel? What? Tell Ron what your channel is. Julian Trucher Flash. What is it? Julian Trucher Flash. All right, you guys go subscribe to him. You want to hop in there? Go ahead. I can't believe I'm happy. It was loud? <laughs> they all like it. Ram it, dude. Rev it up. No, I do it. Let me hit it It's that first one. Huh. Yep. <laughs> Alright, <baby. laughs> right, guys, so we are here at Jaded Brand's house. We got the Mustang. He got his AMG. His new rap, you guys gotta go check it out on his channel. He's right here, so make sure you guys go subscribe to his channel. Check us out. First link in the description, he Jaded also has a red eye right there. The camera is giving me a little weird vibe right now, all right? But here is his red eye. It's camo as well, he got a pretty cool camo on there. Let me show you guys around. Look at that. So he got the army green camo. It looks really good, it's not lowered, right? Nope, so that's his red eye. Let's hear his AMG start. Woo! And this thing is stock. Could you guys believe that? You're good. So we're about to swap some cars out. He's gonna move that. And then we're gonna bring the red eye here because we're gonna actually take it off for a drive. And we're not just taking it off for a drive. We're gonna try to do some high speed pulls in it. Last time I came here, we went out and did it, but my GoPro shut down for some odd reason and we're doing it again. So it's gonna be fun. I get to do it twice now. So he's gonna move some cars around then we're gonna take the red eye out. in there and take it out for a drive all right let's get in here Woo! we're in this red eye let's get some light in here let's go for a ride now all right guys so we're gonna put in a custom mode power at 797 transmission and track paddle shifters on traction and street because uh we're still on stock tires suspension is in street because that is at its softest and steering wheels in track because it's gonna be really stiff so we're gonna get on here and try to do some, you know, high speed pulls while still, you know, of course, going the speed limit. Oh man. So I'm still waiting for traffic to clear up. And by the way, one cool thing about these cars is they perform so well for being 4,300 pounds. All right, so we have some room. Woo! Oh my god, this thing pulls and it just keeps going and going. We ended up getting cut off by this truck, but it's okay. It's still only 40 degrees out, so it's not, you know, the warmest weather. I think we could do a, a little pull right here. crazy thing is a lot of people say how heavy these things are but they don't stop pulling they just keep going and going and going like I could have took this all the way up that's just crazy it just doesn't stop pulling and for those of you guys who don't know this is a Hellcat red eye so it's not a regular Hellcat which is why you know it has 797 here so the regular Hellcat comes with 707 this one comes with 797 it has a bigger blower it pretty much has the demon motor and it also has a beefed up transmission so this thing is nothing like a regular Hellcat the only difference between this and a demon is the suspension so the suspension and the rarity of the car I don't even know if rarity is a word but I guess I just used it so we have some room to do a quick pull right here I'm gonna do a 60 roll It's, it's, it's 
nuts, okay? It's nuts. And it doesn't matter if my red eye is modified. This thing is so fast that it doesn't matter if you're hopping from a modified car to into this. This thing is still fast, it's still quick. And obviously you have the Brembo brakes, so the, you know, the stopping ability is like so quick. They work so well and what just revved at me. I hope that wasn't that charger that tried to rev at me. So we got some more room right here. stretches I, I'm gonna put the window down so you guys can hear how how it sounds okay that's probably way too loud the, do you guys hear the brutal downshift and that's what I mean it's a beefier trans than a regular Hellcat when I had my other Hellcat you know my 17 one the regular Hellcat my trans didn't sound like this. It didn't downshift this aggressive. And this thing is all the way stock. So it's not like it's tuned or has a trans tune. It's all the way stock. And that's what you guys are getting. Listen, listen to these, listen to these downshifts. Wow, ready? Look at this. We're gonna do one more. And then and, and you hear the exhaust and you hear the whine. And I know this exhaust could be a little louder. It's stock exhaust pretty much. So I'm gonna talk him into doing something to it. Maybe mid muffle delete, I don't know, take out the cats, resonator, something. We gotta talk him into doing that. So once I head back, I'm gonna talk to him into doing that. But I think we could still do more pulls. So let's go out and do more. We can do a 60 roll here. stop okay I think I should stop right you're like telling yourself okay so the car is gonna just keep going uh, what's what's exactly happening you're telling yourself like okay I think I should stop because if I don't stop the car won't stop okay it, it's not one of those cars where you know when you're going up in speed it's gonna just slow down or it's gonna die down like a Tesla no this thing is gonna keep going and it's gonna keep going and it's gonna keep going and it's gonna keep going and it won't stop so yeah, you either get yourself hurt or you just tell yourself to stop because this thing will not tell you to stop. It'll be like, okay, I guess we're going all the way to 200 miles per hour. And it is very much capable of doing that. So I'm debating on maybe doing one more pull. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. I don't know, should I? I've done enough, but I think um, eh, maybe we can do one more, okay? One more, we'll do just one more. We'll do like a 50 roll. Since you know we have no nobody in front of us. That's enough guys. That is enough. We've had too much fun with this red eye. And and if you haven't experienced it. Please go out and experience it. I feel like everyone should be able to experience one of these cars. You gotta go out there, even if it's not a red eye, even if it's a regular Hellcat, go out there and experience it. This thing is nuts. And a lot of people that down talk on this car, just frankly, just don't know what this feels like. And if they've driven it once, then they didn't go all out. Because once you go all out in this car, it's gonna put the biggest smile on your face and the raw power of this car there isn't a car out there that has it. For the price of this car, this car is about a $90,000 car, 
Might be a little cheaper, depends on you know the options you go with. Find me another car out there for about ninety thousand dollars with seven hundred and ninety-seven horsepower. Could you believe that? Seven hundred and ninety-seven horsepower, and it pulls like that. And you got all this room, so you got plenty of room. Even though it's a Challenger, it's one of the biggest coupes out there. So you have you know pretty comfortable seats in the back. You got the Laguna leather right here, and you guys know I'm a big Mopar fan, and I always tell people, okay. This is the most fun you're gonna have in a car. It's gonna be in this car. Trust me, it's gonna be in this car. Let's hear the downshift. Brutal, brutal, one more. All right, so here's what we gotta do. You gotta get an exhaust to this. I hear it all the time. You have to. This I thing is it. too quiet. I Way too quiet. Time. I hear it all the time. You need an exhaust. You right. sound like Nate and you sound like Josh. Right away. But you, you got to get the right exhaust set up. So I think like a mid-muffle delete will be good. Because I'm like downshifting and you, you barely hear it. How many times have you heard me <laughs> say the very he got, thing? He has to. We heard the same thing about the exhaust. One thing with me is that I like the quiet sound. Not obnoxious. I like that quiet sound. <laughs> It won't be. We always talk about, you know, but I don't want to be too loud, like obnoxious, like Josh's car. Yeah, that's different. I think he, his is all straight piped. It so is. I think a mid muffler delete would be just perfect. It'd be just perfect. I think it'd be just perfect. And then when you put it in like eco mode, it'll quiet down a little bit. Okay, okay. If you really want, you could get cutouts. Now I thought about that because I could have a stock sound and then I could have a cutout. Yep. And I that's that's, that's that. kind of what mine is really. Mine so is a, it, it's not cutouts, but I have the active exhaust, which when I turn it down, you guys want to hear it? Yeah. All right, we're going to, we're going to play it for him. So that brings us to the end of today's video. Make sure you go subscribe to my friend. First link in the description. He has the Red Eye, he has the AMG, and he has a bunch of other cars on the channel. So make sure you go check him out. But if you guys like today's video, give it a big thumbs up. If you're new to this channel, make sure you go subscribe, browse through the channel, leave a like, comment. The more you guys engage, the better it is for me. So I would highly appreciate you guys do that. But now I'm gonna let you guys go. So I hope you guys go out there and have a beautiful, beautiful day. Peace out and see you on the next one. Woo!